Skinny time. We start with the Tony Awards. Okay. Last night's big winners. One of the first of the night was a history maker. A tearful one at that. Audra McDonald won her sixth Tony. <clears throat> Excuse me for her portrayal of Billie Holiday in Lady Day at Emerson's Bar and Grill. The award put her ahead of five-time winner Angela Lansbury. I want to thank my mom and my dad up in heaven for for disobeying the doctor's orders and not medicating their hyperactive girl and finding out what she was into instead and pushing her into the theater. <laughs> Thank you, Mom. Well, and to the award for Best Leading Actor in a Musical, Neil Patrick Harris won for his amazing performance in Hedwig, The Inch, uh, the Angry Inch. But before the award was given, he had a chance to show the audience what it was all about. John Cameron Mitchell and Stephen Oh my God, Harris looking pretty good in drag. He lost 23 pounds to get ready for the role. I didn't know he had 23 pounds to lose. I know. That was, that was some performance. <laughs> it was pretty he's, incredible. He's tremendous, isn't he? Yeah. All right, tonight's biggest award, best musical, went to a gentleman's guide to love and murder about a caper set in 1909 London that turns murder into merriment. A gentleman's guide topped the nomination count with 10. Some of the night's other big winners, best play went to All the Way, starring Breaking Bad's Brian Cranston. Love that guy. And Cranston won the prize for leading actor for the best revival of a play, A Raisin in the Sun, which stars Denzel Washington. For best actress in a musical, Jesse Muller, who plays the title character in Beautiful, the Carol King musical.